Space Dragon and Kim. I'm shaking the soda bottle all over the place. I shake, 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 shake. I can't wait to see Kim's face. Hey, Space Dragon. Hey, Kim. I bought you this delicious scream soda to say thanks for letting me babysit your pet budgie. He was delicious. What? Delightful. Oh. I meant to say <laughs> delightful. Well, thank you. That is very sweet of you. Thanks, Dragon! <laughs> that was amazing. Let's see that again in super slow-mo. Space Dragon, did you shake it? What? My booty? Yeah, buddy. Yeah, I shook it. Um. Oh, oh, the pop? Yeah, of course I shook it. I shake all my food before I eat it to make sure it's not gonna put up a fight. <laughs> Nothing. So why did the soda fly everywhere like that? Oh, well, there's a perfectly scientific explanation for that. Air pressure and stuff. Yeah, what he said. Air pressure and stuff. You see, at all times, there is about 15 pounds of pressure pushing on every square foot of us, squeezing us from all directions. Kind of like this. Mustard crush! <laughs> Mustard everywhere. That was awesome. Okay, but like, why aren't we being squashed then? Like that poor, poor mustard bottle. The reason is because there's the same amount of pressure inside your body pushing back outwards so that you don't get crushed. <laughs> Take that, air! You can't crush me, you punk! Mm -hmm. <laughs> but what does air pressure have to do with a soda pop exploding? Okay, well, the soda manufacturers squeeze a ton of carbon dioxide gas into the pop. Gas! Yeah, gas. <laughs> Grow up. Grow up. Carbon dioxide gas. So there is a ton of pressure inside the bottle wanting to get out. And when you shake that bottle, a bunch of bubbles of that carbon dioxide gas form and cling to the sides. And when you open it, the high pressure drops quickly, making those bubbles expand and rush to escape the bottle, bringing the liquid along with it. Ugh, that's so boring. Oh my God. And complicated. Oh my God. I'm not sure I understand air pressure any better than I did before. Okay, 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 okay. Well, it's a good thing that I had this air pressure experiment already ready to go. How convenient. <laughs> now, do not try this at home or anywhere without a responsible adult present. We are professionals. Yeah, well, Kim is an expert. I'm pretty much just a six foot tall alien dragon who eats sweaty gym socks because they taste delicious to me. True. Now, when air is heated, uh -huh. it expands and becomes less dense than the cool air around it what? and rises out of the bottle. Huh? So there are fewer air molecules pushing up on the egg now and more air pushing the egg down. So it gets sucked into the bottle. Wait, so air pressure can blast stuff out of bottles and also suck stuff into bottles? Yes, you can even squeeze an empty water bottle to make a cloud. <gasps> you see, the high air pressure squishes all the leftover water molecules together, like this. Cool, but uh, I'm still a bit confused. This is so frustrating. Well, I'm about to turn that frustration into excitement. So, keep this, lizard face. Okay. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna take regular old plain water. Whoa. And I'm gonna put it in a cup, just like so. And the idea here is to try and fill it up to the tippy top, but don't overfill or anything. Okay. Got it? Got it. Got it. Got okay, it. then I'm gonna take this regular paper plate, nothing fancy, just normal, and I'm gonna put it on the top of the cup. What? Don't Are flip it ready? upside down, it'll I'm spill. Flip it upside down. Don't do it. I'm gonna do it. Are you ready? <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> the water doesn't fall out. What? That is because air is pushing up on the plate, but it's not pushing down on the water because the glass is blocking it. So like a vacuum forms inside. Okay, mm. I get it. Yeah. So the water pushing down on the plate is lighter than the air pushing up on the plate. So the air wins the pushing battle. Air pressure's awesome. Oh. Let me try. No, no, no! Space <laughs> <Thanks>, dragon! <laughs> Oops, uh, give me an R. R? Give me a 
U. U. Give me an N. N. What does that spell? Run. Good idea. You better run. <laughs>